Every four years, basketball programs are allowed an out-of-the-country trip to play exhibition games. In 2012, the Rebels went to Canada, but this year they're going somewhere a little more tropical, the Bahamas to be exact. But what's more important than the mini vacation the team will take is the bonding that they will do. Being that the team has finally settled in from all of the drama of the offseason, the guys can finally get to work. We haven't really played with each other before, so we're just gonna le we're learning each other's game, like I said. Um, we're, be we're able to compete against other teams, so we're able to see where we stand against other competition. The trip itself is, is, is a combination of practices and, and then the preparation for travel, getting used to you know, what it is to travel with uh, under my you know, kind of uh, guidelines. Um, and then obviously some competition, see what the guys look like when they actually play with officials and against other teams. Uh, so there's a lot of benefits, and I can go on about the small things, but all those small things are going to add up for us because we haven't experienced them together yet. The team is allowed 10 practices before they leave to their trip, and you might think that the guys would be more excited about the beaches and bikinis, but some say otherwise. Uh, that's not the, it's not the time for that down there because we're going into a big season. We have a big season coming up, so I'm not really paying attention to all that. That's more distractions. The team will play in the Bahamas August 14th through the 18th and hope to take advantage of the time there to really get to know everyone's style of play before the season starts. For the Rebel Report, I'm Cassie Soto.